really an exercise in futility. I am talking about The Family Chantel, season five, episode six, the series finale, Parting is Such Sweet Sorrow. And y'all, again, an exercise in futility. Nothing was accomplished. There was a little bit of drama, but honestly, it, it really wasn't even worth watching for all the good it did. On this episode, we know that they're coming off the heels of Lydia and Nicole sending the box of witchcraft and wizardry to Chantel's family. Chantel doubles down and says, you know what? I'm going to go and see y'all face to face and get that off, get this off my chest. Now she's saying that this was in an effort to gain resolution, some closure to the entire situation. It really wasn't. I feel like it just opened up old wounds. It. I mean, we're talking about things that at this point don't even matter. On this episode, I can agree with Pedro in that y'all. It was, it was just really sad. So, you know, she commanded the spirit in Pedro to meet her in Dominican Republic with his family and the spirit obeyed because he ended up coming there uh, and they sit down and they have a talk and basically she is kind of laying out her list of grievances and the fact that she believed he never loved her that he used her you know and that she felt as though he was cheating with Karima, that he was cheating with the ladies at the agency uh, and he's saying you know what Chantel I was an awful husband I was bad I could have done things better he did not cheat he, he insists that he did not cheat meanwhile Lydia's laughing Nicole is cussing Chantel out, acting just a mess with a mask on because she says her teeth are separated as far as the East is from the West right now. Um, it was just really a gross display. I think what, have, what may have been better is just the two of them because we know from the beginning that their issue was the families, Chantel's family and his family. Now, I, both families, were terrible in terms of their intrusion into the relationship. But I don't care what y'all say, Lydia and Nicole took it to a whole other level. The level of vitriol and hate that they spewed was gross and disgusting. Miss Karen, you know, she <laughs> is what she is and it wasn't acceptable either. But I mean, at this point, y'all are divorced. I, I don't understand the purpose of this conversation, especially with how she received it. You know what I mean? She got super emotional. And you know, River's like, you know, how would you feel if this was your sister? And Pedro's like, I don't have anything to say. I'm upset all that he that I've had that I can say. And he said, you know, I believe it is really sad for her to think, you know, that we were together and I never loved her. At the end of the episode, they do go down memory lane and we get to see them from 90 Day Fiance, and they were both so young and so seemingly in love. It's is really hard for me to believe that he had malice in his heart back then. Now, what shifted in these seven years, what went on that we didn't actually get to see, I don't know, but there was such a shift in Pedro um, towards the end. This was kind of the first time I saw him open up in several seasons where I did feel like um, he was communicating earnestly with Chantel. And when he said, you know, I want the best for her, I believed him. I want Chantel to heal though. I mean, bitterness is like a sickness and it's a root and it can cause all kinds of bad things in your life. So I'm praying that she can forgive him ultimately and let it go. Um, we know the forgiveness isn't about Pedro, it's about her and her moving on successfully and not being bitter and carrying that into the future. Um, and it, it was kind of heartbreaking. I can't lie. It made a real G cry a single tear like Denzel did in Glory watching kind of the recap where they started to now and it was <sighs> i don't know it was the end of an era i guess y'all but that was it again not you know it was what it was you know some people are going to be who they are now now listen to me when i say this though i truly believe we're going to see more of these families one way or the other hopefully chantelle does get a show about her healing journey and dating and moving forward. Hopefully we get to see that. That would be awesome to see. But y'all, if you're still here, thanks so much for watching. My name is Ashley and this has been My Sweet Perspective. Please feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see y'all in the next video.